Some say your piece is missing The puzzle seems so incomplete I see a different story The suffering resonates in me Held within my heart forever One day the world will understand I'm Dr. Ed Chicarico, founder of the Pi program and co-founder of the Valley program. Uh, these two programs uh, have helped many, many children with special needs over the years. It has been really satisfying to see the program grow from six children in 1974, and then when Valley was started in 94, starting again with six children, seeing it grow to approximately 150 children. Here at the Valley Program, we strive for a different approach to teaching students with cognitive disorders. Our approach is simple. No two people are the same, so we believe schooling should be just as unique as the needs of each individual student. From the moment a student arrives, they receive a distinct greeting and escort into school. Surrounding our students with the best staff is crucial in development, and that is the greatest strength of the Valley Program. To begin, we maintain a high staff to student ratio. We supply 200 employees to serve the needs of 172 students. This allows us for unique one-on-one -on -one opportunities so teachers and students can focus clearly on each other. On average, we are able to provide intense individualized related services averaging two to three hours a week per each student. But isolation isn't the name of the game. We push unique, inclusive opportunities with general, neurotypical education, as well as introduction into the workforce to immerse our students into real-world situations and better equip them for a world outside of school. Most unique to the Valley program is our life skills training. Utilizing the combination of both individual treatment and collaborative approaches, our physical, occupational, speech, and behavioral therapists together teach our children the skills needed for independence outside of the classroom. As more and more students are diagnosed with autism every year, we at the Valley Program believe it's our responsibility to continue to grow and offer aid to as many students as possible. Starting in the 2016 school year, we will be moving our four sites into one consolidated site in Norwood, New Jersey. Moving our multiple sites into one building will help minimize inefficiencies and allow us to customize the space to suit the needs of our students. Now we need your help to secure the funding for the building so we can continue our remarkable work with students. But don't just take it from us. My name is Jeff Hassan and I'm a parent of uh, Jake Hassan who was in the Valley program since the time he was uh, three years old. He's 13 years old now. He had problems when he was in the program. They would come to the house. When he transitioned to school from the Valley program, they came when necessary to school to help out there to course correct. They, they were so creative in what they did. They find out what each kid likes and they use that to try to help him. We, Jake loved animals. They found out with speech by using animals and making animal sounds that brought his speech up to par. It's amazing how far Jake has come. Now he's playing on a travel basketball team uh, that he had to try out for. And all this started with the Valley program and, and learning to take baby steps and working up to walking and working up to, to doing certain activities and now to see him playing basketball is incredible to me. Um, I can't say enough what the program has, has meant to us, not to mention uh, Jake. If it weren't for the Valley program, I'm convinced that Jake wouldn't be where he is today. I'm grateful beyond measure for this program. There's truly no words to describe um, how far my son has come. I'm completely amazed sometimes when I step back and think about it. And I owe all of that to the aides and, and, to the, and all the therapists that are in this school and also to the amazing teachers. It's been an amazing experience, truly. And I appreciate every second.
My name is Jamie England. My son, Mason England, who is five years old, attends the ballet program at OLV in Harrington Park. This was a kid who two years ago didn't notice when anybody walked in the room, didn't answer his name, couldn't do the simplest things like brush his teeth or wash his hands or play games. He didn't want to play with his brother. He didn't want to play with other children. And now you've got a kid who, who looks at you when you talk to him, who's trying to speak, who's starting to say a few words, who plays with the kids on the block, who does well in the classroom, does his lessons. So he's really come a long way. And we absolutely love the school and the program and the teachers. We're just so grateful for everything they've done for him. And I'm really glad we've sent him there. <laughs> can't say enough good about the program. My daughter Miranda came here nonverbal and in four months she was already having language and eye contact. Kids go to school, they learn how to sit at a desk and learn, but it's also about having a life and a child being able to function in the outside world, be able to go to the park and play, go to the store and buy a soda or buy a bag of chips. Those are all things that are very important and the Valley program has given my daughter Miranda so many positive experiences. Everybody that works here wants to be here. Um, it's just a very special place. It's like a second family to me. Department. It has helped me grow into the best me I can be. Your generosity will help us have a home of our own.